Monet vlog. Hey, my name is Amaya Monet and welcome to another week in the life of a wannabe influencer. It's been a second since I've done a weekly vlog because um, it's been kind of rough out here. I haven't really been feeling confident and my content has kind of been reflecting that, well, lack thereof of content. But I did finish a sponsorship this morning, so I am kind of feeling motivated. It is Monday, so it is a good fresh start of the week. We gotta get our mind right. We gotta get to mother in work. There's just been a lot of variables that have been messing with my mood. For example, TikTok might be getting shut down. So that means I'm gonna be out of a job and I'm gonna have to um, look for a proper job, which is okay, like it's it's fine. No, it's not fine. Um, But it's fine, I just haven't applied for a job really ever. Like I haven't been job hunting ever. And I've been hearing a lot of people saying that the job market is rough. <laughs> but let's not put negativity in the air. Let's just hope and pray that TikTok does stay afloat. Cause baby, I'm not making money on Instagram or YouTube. TikTok is the main source of income. But I'm just touching on my makeup because I do have some more filming I need to do. It is currently like three o'clock. Oh, it's actually almost four. <laughs> I literally filmed and edited a video this morning since like eight o'clock. So I just treated myself to laying down for a couple hours, but now it's really time to get to work. No more slacking, no more lacking. There's money to be made and influencer to become. So here's our to-do list and we gotta make sure I do everything on this list. So first I gotta film a closet, another closet clean out video because the people have been begging. Then after that, I need to pack some more Depop orders and I need to go downstairs to my leasing office so they can print out the shipping labels because I don't have a printer and I pay rent and y'all gonna print out these goddamn pieces of paper for free, all right? Y'all should have a printer anyway. Then I need to take some more Depop pictures of the clothes I'm getting rid of after that closet clean out video I filmed. Then I need to redo my hair because I did a different mousse and gel combo and I don't like it. I like the other one I used. And then as my hair dries, I need to clean up my apartment at least a little bit. I need to get ready for bed and then I'm gonna film one last TikTok which is of me doing my nails and talking about my relationship. <laughs> Hold on, my mom's calling. Mommy. Anyways, that's the to-do list. Let's get started. First, I gotta walk this child, and then when we come back, we'll figure out what's the first thing we're gonna do. Okay, so first, we're gonna pack some Depop packages. I have three orders I need to ship out. First is this Dea by Zendaya dress that I literally love so much, but it's just a tad bit too small and it deserves to go to a happy home where they can fit it. Ah! And there's this really cute corset that I got from ASOS. It's just not my style anymore, but it fits really, really well and it's so stinking cute. Happy it's going to a, a happy home. And then finally, and in this shirt, I got called beautiful by Lil Nas X, y'all. Lil Nas called me gorgeous, but it's not my style. I won't wear it, so it's gotta go. I got these super cute bubble mailers from the dollar store. Well, the dollar 25 store, cause- Inflation. Thank you to everyone who has ordered from my Depop because it is going towards my rent. Thank you so much. Even though I am barely making any freaking profit, it, it, it helps, it, it all helps. Orders are all packed and looking pretty. Now I bought this scale off of Amazon and I do my own shipping. So all I gotta do is weigh these, put them into pirate ship, Print out the shipping label and we're done. Super quick and super easy. I highly recommend using Pirate Ship. The shipping actually is pretty affordable. But now we gotta see if my leasing office is gonna print out these pieces of paper for me. They better. Okay, so printing out the shipping labels was a fail because for whatever reason, they're doing hella tours and people are trying to move in here. So I'll try again tomorrow, but we can check off packing the orders. Now I think it's time to film another closet clean out. <sighs> I like really don't want to. But like what else on this to-do list can I do or want to do? Nothing. So let's just do it and get it over with. But first we gotta figure out what I'm gonna wear. And I like to wear like simple basic clothes so I can easily put stuff over it and nothing really clashes. So usually I'll go for a plain top and some plain shorts, but I don't currently have any like clean plain biker shorts. So I guess we'll go with capris. Hopefully that works out, we'll see. I think it's fine, I think it's cool. Honestly, it's gonna have to do because I don't feel like figuring out anything else. Now we need to set up the area in which I film. Welcome to my filming corner. It's also cold as a mother. Ugh. 
Almost a year ago, I put up this chalkboard wallpaper and I drew on it with some chalkboard paint and I really like it. I'm planning on definitely redoing it eventually. But for some reason, I'm just, I just don't know what to paint on it now. Like I feel like what I painted on it is just so perfect. And I'm no artist. So this was a struggle and I, listen, I did good and I don't want to switch it up, but it's getting kind of boring. Hello? Stop tweaking. Also, I have this $60 ring light I got from Amazon. Sometimes it do be tweaking and be glitching, so I have to hit the shit out of it sometimes so it stops. Please, act right. I definitely plan on investing in some more lighting equipment eventually, but right now maybe there's no money on my car. This pile of clothes, I still need to post on Depop, so I'm gonna put that in my room real quick. And the rest of these bags are all clothes are all clothes I plan on getting rid of or keeping. We'll see. But if you've been following me for a second, you know I did a round of going through my clothes before and I've been getting a lot of comments that are like, girl, if you got rid of it before, get rid of it. Why are you, why are you going through it again? It's because it's fun and I barely have clothes in my closet. So it's like, I kind of don't want to get rid of the clothes that I barely have. But I need to hurry up and get to filming so I can continue to have a productive day. Gotta get up, Amaya. All right, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't look like I'm filming I, because I'm not. I need endorphins and I get my endorphins from Gourmet Makes Bon Appetit, okay? I need to be in a good mood in order to film this goddamn series. So let me get my happiness, okay? It is six something, 640 something, I'm pretty sure. Now I'm finally ready to film. I definitely did watch multiple episodes, but now I'm in a good mood. So that's all that matters. So let's get to filming. <sighs> How do I start these videos anyway? But you did a good job at really fucking up my day. Welcome to part, welcome to part three of, welcome to part three, welcome to part three of me going through all the clothes I impulsively purged out of my closet a couple months ago. So none of the clothes that I'm getting rid of, I don't think is worthy of putting on my Depop. I'm gonna put them in a bag and send them to the thrift store. But I barely made a dent in this bag. This series is gonna go on for a while and I'm not mad because it's one of my most viewed videos. Like, so give me them dollars. I don't get paid a lot, but give me them dollars and watch these darn videos. They take a lot to film and edit. So we got that checked off the list. I'm cozy, comfy, laying in bed. There's technically five things that are on my to-do list that I can do, but I don't think I'm gonna do. Actually, stop it now. You need to be more productive, girl. I was about to call myself a bitch. First, I need to catch up on a Korean drama though. That is way more important than all of that because it gives me endorphins and makes me happy. So happiness over everything. I have about 30 minutes left of this newest K-drama called The Pyramid Game. Girly pop, if y'all watch Singles Inferno, Sulky, the one everyone was in love with, she's in this? She's a good actress. And I did not remember her voice being that deep in the show. She's eating, I'm loving it. I fell asleep. Do I see a pimple forming? Damn. Okay, so I fell asleep with my makeup on. I fell asleep without doing anything. It is now Tuesday. Can y'all hear them fucking mowing outside? They've been mowing for two days straight. Shit, they've been mowing since yesterday. Anyway, I look insane. Um, we're definitely gonna fix that later, but the most important thing for this morning is to edit the closet clean out so I can get that up today. And then after I'm done finishing editing this closet clean out, we're gonna make our to-do list for the day and we're gonna check off everything on that list. It should take me about like maybe four hours to edit this video if I like really hone in and focus. I'll just check back in with you once I'm done editing this because this is the number one thing I need to do today. It is now 3.40. I have officially edited it all down to three minutes, added all the sound effects, zooms, everything. I'm officially done. Oh, also if you hear jazz in the background, I figured out just now that jazz really helps me focus. But now that I'm pretty much officially done, I will check back in with you guys once I start getting myself together because we look like a hard day at work. And I want to look like him, sleep and beautiful. <laughs> It feels so shitty and weird to be boohoo crying over fucking TikTok being banned when I'm watching the live stream and your body's like, why the fuck are you crying over TikTok being banned? Bro, this isn't gonna get posted. I'm gonna stop recording because this is so stupid. I have stopped crying. I have come to my senses. Yes, it does suck that um, it did pass the house. 
it still has to go through the Senate. And if it does get passed, then someone has to buy it. Someone in America, the US. But the question is, will China sell it? And I wouldn't blame them if they didn't want to, cause yeah, queen, if you gonna make money, make that shit, bro. But I have time until that decision is made. It's just like, damn, all of my hard work might go down the drain because of some old crusty white people. This is America. And you're probably like, suck it up, bitch. It's not that big of a deal. I'm trying, I'm trying to suck it up. But I haven't cried in a very long time. And usually I cry like once a week or like five times a week. But I haven't cried for a while because I've been happy. I love being in America. Cost is high. I'll probably never be able to buy a house. Don't even get me started on getting a new car. It is now 12.30. I washed my hair. I'm about to do it. I feel a lot better now. I'm being dramatic. It's not getting banned overnight or anything. I don't know why I was tripping like that. I have time to figure shit out. I, I have time to figure shit out, but I'm not going to talk about it anymore. We will make a list as soon as I'm done blow drying my hair. I'm going to use textured leave-in conditioner. I've never used this before. Smells good. I think what really helped me in my mood was listening to Sexy Red when I was in the shower. <laughs> I don't know, there's something about Sexy Red that just gets your, gets your spirits up, man. Sexy Red is like the epitome of hope. I have hope in life and humanity now. But yeah, we are not gonna think about nothing anymore. We're gonna turn on a K-drama, get this hair blow dried, and we can finally start our day. <laughs> trim so bad y'all i really don't got no edges <laughs> i really don't got no edges <sighs> but um i plan on doing mini twist i just wanted to stretch my hair out a little bit more so like the mini twist can have some length to it i actually haven't done mini twists in literal years so i don't know what i'm doing i hope i'm doing the right thing but now that my hair is blow dried let's make a to-do list for the day so first the most important thing i need to do is eat baby it is two o'clock yep it's two o'clock and i haven't eaten a single thing my belly empty i have no food in my stomach but i ordered me some five guys just to treat myself for the trials and tribulations i went through this morning really shouldn't have i have no money but one thing about me i'm gonna treat myself two i need to definitely clean my filming room it is a disgusting sick mess three i need to plan my mini twist vid then i need to film the mini twist vid then i have to call my manager because i texted her earlier freaking the fuck out because tiktok was getting banned and i was like oh my god what do i do like i don't have enough followers on youtube or on instagram like i'm freaking out like what do i do so she was like yeah let's hop on a call girl and then i need to plan some more concepts for my as i am partnership and anything after that we'll figure out later because i don't even know if i'm gonna have time to do all of this stuff but for now i'm not gonna do anything else but wait for my food to get here because my head is hurting and i'm getting kind of cranky <laughs> so yeah okay bye i don't want to dial back in the homemade version but like all the components being so delicious i'm a big fan this is an almond soup. okay y'all it is 404 got off the phone with my manager i didn't film anything just yet because these crying bags have been out of control so i've been trying to ice them for like the past 20 minutes i almost had another breakdown but look we're good we're okay we just gotta take the other platforms just as seriously as tiktok even though it's not gonna make me money it will make me money in the long run but i need money now does it look like i've been crying but it is what time does the sun go down now that it's daylight saving or is it not daylight saving what's the opposite one daylight spending i don't i don't fucking know sun goes on at 7 15 i can be happy again i can be happy again life is good no it's not but life is good welcome to under my covers I have developed a pulsating headache. I have a very bad migraine, talking hurts, and I just can't put contacts in my eyes and pretend like I'm okay to film this video. So it's okay, I will film it at night after I take a nap or just lay down until this headache goes away. And if you didn't watch my get to know me tag, you probably won't know, but I have low key a fear of medicine, so I will not take medicine 
unless it's a dire situation so i'm just gonna rough it out talking hurts i'm gonna shut up now it was a dark and stormy night last night in Amaya's apartment. She started gushing out blood from her nether regions and her stomach was tossing and turning like an alligator getting its prey. Did I eat that? So I got my period last night as I had a migraine. I was done out. So it's the next day. <laughs> my toes are so ugly. I completely forgot about the vlog, but I did get some work done. I did film a video of me doing these mini twists. Right now they're not looking that cute because they're just pushed back. But they're cute. Like I feel like if I add some like maybe some, some beads or something or some like clips or something, I don't know. We're gonna have to try to figure this out because I'm gonna keep this in for like maybe a week. Cause it's a protective style. We need to keep my hair protected because having it out too often is not good for my, my hair personally. But my boyfriend is coming over tonight after he gets off of work. So we got a lot to do today before he comes over because my house looks like I've been depressed. We can't we can't have him see that. But before we get to cleaning, I have some editing and some work to do and some stuff to send over to my manager and stuff to plan. So before we even worry about cleaning, of course, work is our priority. But first things first is getting this video I filmed yesterday edited. And then after I finish editing, 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 editing. Whoa, why can't I say editing? Once I finish editing, I am going to make our to-do list for the day. Hopefully we can check off all the fucking shit on the to-do list in one, like, can we just, can we just have one day where I check off everything on the to-do list? Probably not, but let's strive. Let's strive to be great. It's 10.39. Hopefully I can get done editing this video by, let's say one. I don't think it should take me that long because I'm not gonna be adding a whole bunch of sound effects and everything like that. But it's still a lot of footage to go through. So let's get that done. My forehead is ginormous. <laughs> yes, I am a bully. I don't like seeing him peacefully sleeping when I can't. It's 1.34, I'm so, so close to being done. Oh my goodness, I'm so close. All I have to do is adjust the lighting, sharpen it a little bit because it's not like really clear. For some reason, like it's a little foggy. What are you doing, bro? Having a dog is like having a child, like a legit toddler. Just wants to be all up in my face whenever he wants. And then when I'm in his face, he don't like it. What about now? Yeah, what about now, nigga? What about now? Cool, right? As I was saying, y'all know how like when you upload a video to TikTok and you can choose the cover, like throughout the video, like you can choose like the, you know what I'm trying to say. For whatever reason, whenever I choose that cover, it always just goes straight back to the beginning of the video. And in the beginning of the video, I'm always looking fucking crazy. I'm always like, or something. So I can do that in CapCut, which I did not know about until I went on Reddit and shout out to Reddit for real. So in like the first point two seconds of the video, they'll put that cover on it. So whatever you. Uh. Okay, I walked the child. The child had its exercise. Now it is 247. I really need to eat. But the problem is I ain't got no food. And the food I do have in here is bad. But I'm hungry and I don't want to spend money on food. But I think the fact that there's so much bad food in here is distracting from the fact that I probably do have some food in here. So let's clean out this fridge. It's disgusting and it's sick. You better not, you, listen, I'm depressed. Don't judge me too much. Definitely need to actually clean my refrigerator. But as you can see, I ain't got no food in here. And I don't drink soda, but that was from my Valentine's Day party. So uh -huh, I'm struggling. Let's check the freezer. There's stuff in here, but nothing actually. I have an idea. I can make hot dogs and fries. Yummy! Hello? I really wish I had some beans for my hot dogs because I love me some mashed potatoes. And I love me some hot dogs and beans, y'all. Yee! I don't know why it makes me feel country. <laughs> so this food may look dry to y'all, but baby, it be busting. <laughs> Just plain hot dogs still be busting. I wish I had beans, but get every last shop of that hot sauce. Let me eat my gourmet meal, watch some sea dramas, and I'll check back in with you 
once we figure out what we need to do for the rest of the day. Okay, I relaxed for a little bit too long. It is now 3.50. My boyfriend is be blah, 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 blah. my boyfriend is gonna be coming over after he gets off work around like six. And I, as you saw, I have no groceries in my apartment. So I wanna go to the grocery store, but also I need to clean. So it's like, do I go to the grocery store so I can get food for us? I could just do that when he gets here, but I kind of wanted to surprise him and be like, oh, babe, I'm cooking for you. Even though I cook for him very often, but I wanted to like surprise him with like a recipe also on TikTok. But I guess we're just gonna have to suck that up and just clean because can't be bothered with going to the grocery store. Oh, also I dropped my remote. I dropped the Apple TV remote in my dog's water. So I had to put the TV remote in this bowl of rice. Okay, so what we're, what we're gonna do first is we're gonna clean. Then tonight I for sure have to film that video about me talking about me being a girlfriend for a whole month <laughs> for the first time because because <laughs> in that video i'm gonna be doing my nails and i've been itching to do my nails for so long i just i just need to get it over with i also need to make edits to a sponsor a sponsor post that i have upcoming then i also need to finish prepping for the sit down youtube video i 100 percent need to film tomorrow that's feasible for today um let me get to motherfucking cleaning actually because run out of time and I don't want him to see my depression house. It is now Saturday. My boyfriend just left. He's going back. <sighs> He's going back home. He's going to be gone for a week. I didn't film at all yesterday because I just wanted to spend time with my boyfriend before he left. But now we're on our motherfucking Zoom. We're on our Zoom. We need to get to work. We need to... <laughs> Money to be made, <laughs> content to be created, things to mother flipping do. Saturday, today is gonna be a very productive day. It is already 2.30. I just got off of like a really long phone call with some fellow content creators. That was really, really fucking fun. Like, I love women. I love women so much. While I was on the phone, I've been editing YouTube video because I am trying to get this posted this week, like by Tuesday. So I'm trying to get a head start. But also today I need to film I for short, I don't feel like it. I think today's gonna be it. Ooh. I think today's gonna be editing day. I'm gonna continue to edit this YouTube video and then once I get sick of editing, then we'll officially start our day and try to do something else productive. Maybe, maybe I'll just edit all day. We'll see about that. Update, update. It is now 9.57. Notice anything different about me? I put on an old wig. It needs to be actually styled and stuff but i was tired of them damn twists i felt like a five-year-old i was tired of them damn twists i felt like a five-year-old now this is about to die don't be fucking rude as i was saying i've edited down 13 minutes of this vlog and i have about five ten i have about an hour left of the vlog i need to go through i also didn't film me putting on this hair because honestly if you get up close she's she's not melted but i think i might actually film something tonight I might feel me waxing my pits because she's looking real braidable. And I'm finally, I don't care what anybody says, I'm finally gonna put on some damn nails, okay? And if I don't put on nails today, I don't deserve any happiness in life. So now that I've said that out loud, I'm putting on these damn nails because I know for sure I deserve happiness in life. I don't deserve happiness. I definitely fell asleep as my wax warmer was heating up. I laid down, which was my biggest mistake, and I went to bed. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do now is take a shower, wash my face, get ready for the day, and then I'm still gonna film me waxing my face. I just really need to do that damn nail video. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it because that'll be embarrassing if this whole vlog I said I was gonna do a video and I didn't do it. Cause today's the last day of the, the, the weekly vlog. I gotta do it. Let me go wash my ass. Okay, it is 12, 13, I'm all bathed, ready to wax. I didn't put any moisturizer on my face, so my face is looking like a little, whoa. My face is looking a little and feeling dry because I wanna make sure I don't have any excess oils or anything on my skin when I do wax my face. And I put lip gloss, not on my lips, but on my mustache. I use this air stick. I got off TikTok shop for free. I never promoted it, so they're not ever gonna give me any more coupons for TikTok shop, but I don't care because I'm anti-TikTok shop. I'm tired of seeing those damn videos on my For You page. But let me set up really quick and then let's hurry up and get this filmed and then we'll make our to-do list for the rest of the day. Like I said earlier, I definitely need to invest in some better lighting, but this is gonna have to do for now. Let's get to filming. Spring is here, the weather is nice, and we gotta do something about these pits because I'm ready to bring out my Hoochie Mama outfit. 
done filming that was not fun at all actually it was a lot of fun <laughs> I don't know why, but like, I don't like pain, but the pain that comes from waxing, I kind of enjoy it. Am I crazy? But this is what my bathroom looks like now. I'm going to quickly clean it up and then we'll make our to-do list for the day. Actually, we're gonna put on this Kiehl's face mask first cause my face is actually on fire. I'm, it's like, I'm burning. Oh, oh, I needed that. All right, let's just use your hands. Mm. Oh, that feels so good. Okay, we're gonna keep this to-do list super short and super simple. I'm first gonna edit the TikTok I just filmed. I'll maybe edit an Instagram version of it. Then I wanna continue to edit down this YouTube video so I can actually get this posted on Tuesday. Finally, just cleaning. Cleaning is 100% more important than anything else I need to do because I need to get my life together. And then tomorrow's a new week and we'll really, really fucking focus. Whoa, really? I really need to focus. And we will. It's 1.53 right now. I'm honestly gonna leave this face mask on until I'm done editing. Hopefully it shouldn't take me that long. I'm hoping for maybe two hours. We know me, I have no concept of time. 4.13, I have begun exporting. We are done. This was actually extremely fun to edit. I'm actually very hilarious. Um, I hope everyone else finds I'm funny, finds me funny. English? No, don't speak that language again, apparently. Wow, okay. We're gonna shut up now. Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Drew here from Lone Fox and I have to be removed and the entire wall has to be patched up so I've been documenting. It is 6.10 now. I walked my dog, I ate, watched a couple videos. Now I'm gonna be editing for the rest of the day pretty much or until I get tired. Cause I really, really, really wanna have like a upload schedule. Really bad. So let's get to editing. Just to treat myself for the trials and tribulations I went through this morning. What the fuck? Do men ruin everything? <sighs> this is not about my boyfriend. This is about a random ass man disrespecting me and my boyfriend. Tell me why I'm out of my business watching my Korean dramas after I'm taking a break after editing my YouTube video, right? I get a FaceTime call from a random ass number. It was a 571 number and that area code is Virginia. So I'm like, oh my gosh, it must be somebody like I didn't save their number because I don't be saving people's numbers, right? So I answer, turns out it's a man and I'm like, oh shit. Uh, didn't mean to pick that up. Did thought it was a friend. I didn't save their number or something like that. And then the guy's like, "Oh, I miss you." This, that, and the third. And I'm like, "Pause right there. I have a boyfriend." Then he's like, "Oh, how long have I been dating?" And I fucked up answering that damn question. I was like, "Oh, just for a couple months. Like we're very happy, everything like that." Trying to be nice, trying to let him off smooth, whatever. He's talking about, "Oh, like." Y'all are in the honeymoon phase, like y'all are in the beginning of the relationship. That don't mean nothing. Like he was like, you wanna have some fun, like this, that, the third, like you want another boyfriend, some shit like that. I ended that conversation right there. Hung the fuck up, cause don't fucking play me, nigga. Right? So then So then this man proceeds to call me three times. He's like, bruh, lol, like, where's my phone? Where's my phone? Then he says, bruh, lol, just answer, miss you, babe. Babe, babe, we talked for one fucking night over a year ago. Babe, I said, I have a boyfriend, exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. Then I was about to block him, but then I was watching a Korean drama, so I was get, I was two and two in the Korean drama. I wasn't like gonna go through all that now. Nah, it was getting good, right? He continues to call me and says, it's fine, y'all not that serious. He not gonna give you fun like I do though. Don't you ever disrespect me or my fucking boyfriend ever. I blocked his ass immediately and I've been pissed ever since. How dare you be disrespectful? You think that's gonna make me come to you and be like, oh, you're right, my boyfriend is shit, I love you. No, but like what goes on through men's brain that gives them the audacity to say some shit like that? Ah. Anyways, night ruined, end of the vlog. We'll start over tomorrow because I'm pissed. I can't, I'm, I'm going to bed mad. I can't do nothing else but be mad and watch my Korean dramas. I'm taking out my contacts and my eyes are dry. Oh, God damn it. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry this week was a mess. Sorry the ending is a mess. Um, good night.